All right, get on in here. Let's see what else is going on. What else is going down for you this weekend, baby? This is your general weekend message. Whatever is happening here can be happening physically and or spiritually. For some of you guys, it's going to be both. All right, or coming towards you this weekend between you and your person. So always take what is for you. Simply leave what is not yours. If you don't know already, I am your Shaman Empress, a.k.a. the Shaman Hummingbird, baby. I'll be reading all the signs and the energies that I see for you, so don't you worry about a thing, all right? Make sure that you are also subscribed to your area's only placement, Love Tarot, all right? Anywhere areas is in your chart, not just your four major houses. Get your messages. Some of you guys get your tea, get your lemonade, get your coffee, get did whatever you you need okay pop some popcorn baby do what works for you but get what you need to know all right <laughs> um the energy is fluent it will fluctuate back and forth between you and your person okay so let's see what is going on if you don't know already i am your shaman empress aka the shaman hummingbird all right let's see what's going on with you guys hope everybody is doing well again happy mother's day to you i did do a mother day message it's the unisex reading all right with the energy of mother's day being around for the weekend you know what was the energy between you and your person okay so make sure you take advantage of that and also look for your four major houses so you are getting that okay so you know you got a water placement and you got some earth placements that you need to be making sure you watch your earth bender and the water bender message okay messages for the collective for this weekend almighty beautiful universe and holy spirit thank you so we are splitting it right here uh oh page of cups somebody here wants to apologize somebody here is trying to figure out how to get you an apology how to get you to open back up um how to express some kind of emotion towards you this could be a water bender cancerian pisces or an scorpion aqua Aries or a pisces Hmm. Some of you guys just ate some goldfish. The goldfish has improved on a snacks, honey. Okay, I do know that. But some of you guys could have just ate some goldfish. Someone here has one of them dishes that you open up or you have something. You could just contain stuff in it that could sit in the table. Oh, spiritual hiccups. Somebody here, when you go in your house, open the door, you have like a table at your door. This could be where you sit your keys. Hmm. Sorry, spiritual hiccup, guys. I can't help it. I'm so sorry. Some of you guys are Trojan fans. You could be into the Knights or something like that. Um, somebody here has also watched the Spartacus. Mm -hmm. Some of you guys have a water cooler at work or some shit like that. Some of you guys could have also cracked your window at your job. Some of you guys drink coffee at work. Hmm. The two of pentacles. Yep, the six of cups. This person's been going back and forth for a while, the last six months, whether they was going to do this or not. This is about something that happened in the past. This could be also somebody here that's been trying to dodge karma. Scorpion energy, Capricorn here, but they can't get around it. Yeah. All right, what else is popping up for you? We got the page of pentacles. Here comes the good news, ten of pentacles. Somebody here, is one, they want to work with you. They want to connect with you. Yep, they want to come. Somebody here wants to text you, wants to reach out to you and ask, can they come over? Somebody here wants to know, all right, who's all over there? Meet me at your people's credit or something like that. Your aunt's house, the hangman. This person stuck on you. Oh, the hermit. They feel, yeah, the seven of swords. Oh, hell no. See, this person here is sneaky. They could want to apologize about, like, some gaslighting they did to you or some shit like that. This could be even some ghosting. But the problem is they could still be, like, doing that. They could still be doing shit. It's like, what the fuck? Like, so you did all this to do this shit again? And it's like, yeah, if you let me, I need a piece of your energy. That's basically, yeah, honey. Oh, child, they want some sex, too. Ooh, this person want to kiss you. They want to put their arms around. They might lift you up off the ground a little bit, baby. Okay? Because they want justice. This is sexual justice it look like to me, child. Mm. This person also tell... Oh, somebody here. When they have sex, they talk. And you need to listen. That's what she said. Oh, yeah. They going to tell you how they feel and shit. Oh, my gosh. 
But there's no wands here. So their words don't match their actions. What this person is telling you is how they feel, but they do something different. Yeah. They, now the ones in the high priestess, there go your ones hiding from you. They hide them. And it's like, because they, they do something different. Yeah, they do. And this is also somebody here that shows you something different than they show, like, they have a different face just for you. You might get a certain sap from this person that they don't give other people, though. Mmm. Child. I mean. The thing is, it's we are getting too old for that shit. Why do you keep... Why would you want to get... It's like they want to get back on your energy, but... An opportunity opens up for them to do the same thing, and they might do it. So even though they're telling you how they feel, they might not be ready to act on it. They're just letting you know how they feel. And you know, when they start telling you that shit, it, it, it gets into your cups. Ooh, in the night of cups. Then you start feeling some kind of way, like, you feel like that? Well, I feel like that, too. Now, somebody here could feel a little stronger with the knight and the page, though. For some of you guys, you got a child with this person? Now, I'm going to tell you something. Somebody here could be hiding a child. That's what you don't know. Okay? With the hermit and the page of cups and the seven of swords. They could be, like, stuck in a situation. Child, I know somebody ain't trying to sneak out the goddamn... Somebody here is trying to sneak out away from their family. Do you understand what I'm... Listen, the Ten of Pentacles and the goddamn Seven of Swords. Somebody here is trying to sneak from their family. They're going to get in their car. And this could be... it. Somebody here going to call you from their car. They're going to text you from their car. Child, I'm dying. But you don't know they're sneaking, they're hiding. In fact, they could have a newborn. Pages are like months old. Mm. <clears throat> Some of you guys could have like a newborn and a teenager, or this person does, that they're sneaking away from. They're stuck in another Ten of Pentacles. That's where the juggling and the gaslighting is coming from with the two of pentacles and the hermit. And you're trying to figure the shit out. And this could be somebody here, to be honest. They drive two cars, their car, and they got them spouse's car, wife's car, whoever they ain't got them ten of pentacles with. So you know. So they might not have the same vehicle. And they could be doing stuff to throw you off. This person has feelings for you, but they, they, they have no business having feelings for you. That's what I'm getting. Mm. This could be somebody here. It's like they gon they can't help but want to connect with you if you let them in. Of course they're going to connect with you. That's what she said. But will they gaslight you again? Of course they will because they have to. That's what she said. Child, we got to see what's going on, child. We got uh, one zero two seven. Let's get your angel number, then we're going to go a little deeper. Okay, 1027. Also, can we look at that as 127? Okay, this angel number is believed to hold a powerful message from the divine realm. If you see this, this is sad that your angels are encouraging you to take a leap of faith and start something new. For some of you guys, you're, you're stuck in a cycle with this. Let me tell you something. You will be stuck in a hangman with this person because they are stuck in a hangman situation. So it's like an energy projection. So you might be encouraged from the um, universe to do something different, do something new, because this, this is not going to grow for you the way that you think it is. And this could be somebody here. This is why for some of you guys, it's like the page. Somebody here got two young babies and a teenager. And that's what they're, they're being sneaky about. And, and this is also somebody here. It's like they can't 
they can only give you a page. So if this person give you a pentacle, they got they it's like nine is somewhere else. Mm. And they can give you a couple here and there. When they sneak and do it. No. Okay, I don't child. Um the seven of swords. The Knight of Wands, they want to sneak that wand over there, child. On that said. box. Wop. Okay? Something like that. Yep, this king of... Child, look at this right here. The king and the Knight of Wands. They don't get no more realer than that. Whether this is a man or a woman, that's what they want to do. What's the Seven of Swords? Aqua Aries energy. We also have Virgo here. Tesaurus is here. The Wheel of Fortune. Somebody here is trying to turn the wheel. Yeah, Six of Cups. There is somebody from your past wants to come back. They shouldn't have been with you the first time they was with you, but they're coming back. And they know they might have to go show ass again, but they got, they feel like they got to just, they got to come to you. They got to connect to you. Child, the Five of Swords, they got to. They cannot stay away from you, and they know they might have to portray you, but that's a decision they feel like they'll make it when they come towards it. Yeah. Because this person here feels like, you know, they might already have an empress, but they also feel like you're an empress. So I don't know how this is. Yup, temperance you are. Some of you guys are earth angels or earth stars or something like that. What's the hermit? Child, what? What is the hermit? Thank you, Holy Spirit. The chariot in reverse. Uh-uh. See? The Ten of Pentacles. And I told you, that's what they're hiding. The Ten of Pentacles. That's what they're hiding. And this is somebody here, to be honest. They cannot. Yep, they're going to have to hold back. You're not going to hear from this person. It's like you're going to be left waiting. The hangman. What's the hangman? What's the hangman? Yup. Mm-mm. The devil and judgment. And you're going to be fucking pissed off. This is going to turn toxic fast. Quick. We got the knight of spears in reverse. Yeah. Because some of you guys are going to start doing things. You know, you might start making some impulsive decisions. Like, I'm about to go over here and snap out. I'm about to... That's why they won't want you to know the car that they drive. Child, this person... Uh, what is going on with the energies? I, who's a Dr. Umor fan? I almost said that shit twice. What is going on with the energies? What is going on with the energies? This person here don't want you to recognize a certain vehicle. Because when you see it again, it won't even be the same. It won't it won't be them driving it anyway. You won't even think it's them. And this is somebody here to be honest, because they don't want you to do something, recognize them, fuck up the card. They're trying to like cover their bases. Yep, the King of Swords, the Knight of Cups, and the Five of Pentacles. Somebody here, well, I'm gonna say this. For some of you guys, this is somebody I heard almost say another one night stand with you. Period. Yep, eight of cups, and then they gonna walk away. They have a connection. Yup, they are the moon core. This is this is ridiculous. Um, what's the two of pentacles? Yeah, they just confirmed that for me. This is ridiculous. Um, this is uh, this is the thing. Somebody here is trying to like. Come up with a way to reconnect with you. But they know they got to do the same thing. And as much as it's like they got to, I don't know what it is, what it is about you that they got to come back around to. What's the two of, two, of, two of pentacles? The six, of, I told you. In the traditional tarot, the six of pentacles is two, this person giving it to two people. And the Queen of Pentacles, yep, they do. They give to somebody that they have on a high pedestal, Nine of Swords, and they're nervous about 
the Ace of Cups about you finding out if this could be somebody new, a new relationship that they're in. Yep, the Five of Swords. And they're playing mind games with you, the Seven of Pentacles. Yep, that's who they're investing all their time with and putting their pentacles together with. The King of Pentacles. Here it is. The King and the Queen of Pentacles. They could be an engagement or um, about to get. Yep, they are. Ace of Pentacles, they are. And this is somebody here. This person was dating. They could have dated a couple times before they met this person. The yep, they were the Seven of Swords. The Eight of Wands, yeah. And when they come to talk to you, they have to sneak. The Eight of Swords, yep. They have to, they have to sneak because they're stuck. The Three of Wands. And they have to wait for, they have to leave you waiting to come towards you. Someone here knows that you're not going to be with this. You have the two of swords in reverse. So, you know, this is wild. I don't know what to say, y'all. Uh, this is like, what is going on out here? Uh, it's like, what's happening? Let's get you some more tea. It's been lit. All these messages has been lit, honey. This person, you got somebody that wants you back. You, and this person here still ain't going to tell you the truth about, like, they hide their, their, their life. That they have a life with somebody. Someone here could also have two dogs. This could be Great Danes or Dalmatians or something. Okay. I just heard Doberman Pinscher. Somebody here got a Doberman Pinscher. Somebody here also has a goldfish or a little fish at their job. Oh my gosh! We got creeping. Child, they creeping over there. Yep, travel. Oh my gosh. Yep, jackpot. Somebody here could want to... Oh, this person here wants to like compensate you though. Because they have a thing for you that can't let go. They feel like both of you guys feel this shit. Clout hunger says anything, does anything, makes shit up dramatic. And they will say and do anything, anything to get this opportunity. Uh, I, 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 child, there ain't nothing, there ain't no other way to put it. What else is going on here? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Nightmare and memory, they can't stop thinking about you. You are basically haunting this person at this time. And for some of you guys, this may haunt you. This person wants you to go crazy about them. I really feel like that. Like, they want you to, like, look for them. They act like, oh, yeah, they do. I'm going to have to grab another deck. Oh, my gosh. Because I don't feel like pausing the video to get it. What else is going on here? Yeah, they do. And all this whole time, they got somebody. Y'all, what the... All right, what? Oh, the the Knight of Wands, child. They want to. Oh, somebody here want to smack it. They want to spank it, honey. Seven of Swords, and this is a sneaky ass text message that's coming to a hood near you. Seven of Wands, but your phone might be blocked, or you got a different number, or you blocked them. I told you, this person. I, this person has talked to a couple people before they got engaged to somebody. So you know that. So this is, and you could be. There's something about you that got them thinking about you again. Yup. Concern. So it's like, yeah. They, they this this is like there is talk about this other connection. There is talk about an uh, engagement and marriage. This could be commonwealth, like somebody they live with. There's talk about this shit. Yeah, but this person here, Nine of Cups, this is somebody here that um also could be cheating in their connection. Or they're going to. I mean, first of all, they want to cheat with you. That's Let's just be said. clear. They could have even gotten married and was connecting to you when they were engaged. That's what she said. Take it how it resonates. Damn, like, what is going on? Let's, ooh. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Confirmation is what I'm getting. Um, let's put this, see what this person want to say. Wait a minute. 
Her show me a death child. This shit is lit. Hold on. Oh, here it is. Oh my gosh. All right. What's the written messages? Oh. I feel like a fool for losing you. Well, God what she said. damn. I can't make it up. Oh my gosh. I don't feel like this person feels secure in this marriage. They could have been doing their thing, dating around, got engaged to somebody and got married and really started sitting with their feelings now that they had a chance to sit with self. And there you are. I must admit that I'm longing for your touch and warm embrace. I cannot make it up. They are like tripping over you. You just would not understand what I'm going through. Most days I don't understand myself. This is somebody here that has mild concerns all of a sudden. Yup. Yup. They could be secretly feeling like everything that they should be feeling for you, they should be feeling for this person. They might not have married for, like, cups. They could have married for, like, stability. It, 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 it couldn't have been, like, love. People that don't marry for love, this kind of shit happens. And I don't think you should ever marry for stability. Because money come and go. When you got love, you can make it through anything. But when the money change, so will the situation, so will the relationship. And I think I said that shit before. Mm. Let's get some letters and then we're going to get some love oracles, child. Somebody here, yep, the heart chakra. Oh my gosh. First of all, some of you guys could be sons and daughters of Avatar of, of, of Oshun. Their, their heart is with you. They didn't marry or get into a connection with this other person for love. It was based on other shit. Somebody here wants to... It's like they're going to show you what they want you to be okay with, but they know you will never be okay with that. We got X. That could have even been a name like a little food or something you guys just ate. Beta male or female. Someone here is very, very, very like sensitive as well. Yeah, with the cups. This could be a very sensitive person. Shout, let's get some love, Oracles. Okay. We are rocking with this deck. Hold on right here. There's messages in here. Admire. Yup, they love you. Oh my gosh. That's what she said. Because they admire you. They got some kind of this person here. Somebody here could feel like they wrong. They they're starting to feel like they married the wrong person. And I'm agreeing with them because they didn't marry for the right reasons. That's what she said. Ma Ascended Master um, 33 is here. 33 is also connected to the throat chakra. This person wants to talk to you. 3323 is also angel number here. What's the love? Oh my, past life. Oh my God, this is somebody from your past. You share a past life with this person. This is a big obstacle and they know this, but they really admire you. This person here secretly is remarkable. This person is living, their life is miserable. They're not happy. They married for stability and money. That does not mean that you're married for happiness. That's why they're not happy. All right, let's get an oracle message. We're going to start closing this out here, child. Yep, friendship. This is, you could, this could be like, they could have friend zoned you. Yep, dreaming. Now they're dreaming of you. After a while or after some time or some shit. What's the oracle messages? Mm. What's the oracle messages? This person thinks about you guys getting like matching tattoos. Now, for some of you guys in a past life, this connection that you're experiencing with this person. um, Whoever experiences past life uh, connection. There's something that you guys, yep, they just confirmed that for me. There's something that you guys share together. This could be a symbol or marking. This can even be a tattoo. This person remembers you from their past fucking life. That's what she said. 
they know exactly and if that they might not know why they can't let you go but that's why mm. all right so what's the orifice? turn away you turned away from this person's support and gratitude the way you you walked away with this person with gratitude that's why they're so supportive and like of you and admire you so much it could be your grace your gratitude the way you carry yourself you showed this person something but y'all are like gods of some sort to each other yeah, they, that's why they can't stop thinking about you. I got to see something. Miracles. This is somebody that's hoping for a miracle. I got to see something real quick. I'm, I'm going to use this one because I'm seeing this one. Yep. They, playfulness. This is somebody here that's going to be playful to try to get back to you. There's balance that needs to be restored. Can I just get one more love message here? Damn. Damn. A message for you. This person knows that there has to be trust regained here. And power. Yeah. This is somebody here that wants to... Uh, this person wants to embrace you. Y'all have roots together. This person here is, ro is like romance. This Somebody here cannot... Yep, this is a sexual union. It's like they have to now I don't I don't want to I have to say something. This person may not be having like sex with the person they're even supposed to be having sex with. It's also something I'm getting and look at this. And this wasn't even supposed to be in this deck that I'm about to use. Love. Their heart is with you. This person is somebody this is a man or a woman that has I told you. To self note the past. Y'all been together in y'all's past life. Y'all have a past life together. Y'all have a past partnership together. They recognize it. They remember it. This is somebody that sent you bluebirds. Yeah. Their heart is with you. They married for stability. <clears throat> the Ten of Pentacles is also like family inheritance. How many times do we see that shit Ask all the time? Shit in like every fucking movie. Um, what's the signs in the uh, planets here? Okay. We have the ninth house sectorias. Yep, this person is wounded. See, this person here, you're they're learning a lesson. Um, since it's like it's been over between you and them. And this is someone here that's been investigating. We have invitation. Yep, and we have Jim Jim in and they want to communicate. They could be doing things. Someone here also could be learning like a harsh reality about a choice they made in their like connection here. Their marriage. Saturn is kicking somebody's ass. Capri on energy. Home. Cancerian fourth house. Yeah. I'm telling you. Somebody here feels like they're in the wrong home. Damn, y'all. Mm. I don't know. I feel like this is somebody that can't stay away from you. And it's like they might think they can. And it's like, all right, it's out my system. I, I, I got to focus on this. I chose this. And they continuously find a way to fight back in your energy and make excuses to leave, only to come back again. Somebody, I just heard, if you let a dog run, he'll find his way home. You're home to this person, and you have not, and you've been home to this person for a very long time, not just this lifetime. They know this, and you know it. However, y'all chop it up. Well, that's different. Oh my gosh. We're going to leave it right here, guys. Um, wow. That's all I can say is wow. Um, 
I don't even know. This is the energy. Some of you guys are really going to have to do, like, maybe a little soul searching to make some decisions. Like, and this is hard. This is not going to be easy. Both of you guys could be betas. Or you could have a lot of water in your charts. All right. We're, um, I love you all. Don't forget to hit that like button. Make sure you hit that bell. Make sure you hit all that will keep you tapped in and tuned into your messages. And you will also be notified when they are ready and available for you guys. I love you all. Stay dope. I'll catch you in your next video. Upload. Ashe and Amon.